Hey everybody, John and Wilkins Harley bringing you this beautiful CVO. And a lot of people have asked, hey, John, can you tell me a little bit more about this? What makes a CVO a CVO? And what makes this CVO different than some of the others that have been available? So here we go. This is a 2021 CVO Road Glide, and this color is called Bronze Armor. It was a 2021 CVO color. And if you aren't familiar, CVOs have grown over the years. Uh, Custom Vehicle Operations is what CVO stands for. And over recent years, they've tried to create themes around the CVO bike. So some have a little bit more chrome, a little bit more brighter and traditional. Some are very dark and some they try to create like a hybrid between the two. The bronze armor was one of their darker hybrids. So this has a lot of black features, um, both the black air intake and a few other things while also introducing some new finishes. So this finish is actually a satin chrome, which looks really cool. gives you a nice touch um, of having something different versus a standard chrome or just straight black. So it gives you a really good contrast that goes great with the color itself, which is a must see in person. Now rolling through the CVO to give you a couple features. Yes, it's a road glide, so the fairing's mounted directly to the frame, but you also notice on the side, it has what's called a fang spoiler, and that's a really nice attachment that allows you to have a really good flow of the color down the front of the motorcycle. It also doubles as a uh, oil cooler shroud on the bottom as well. It just helps tie everything together, gives you a much more premium look and a really nice premium finish. Then rolling on the front, we have a 21 inch wheel. This is the largest wheel Harley puts on a production motorcycle. And this is a cast laced wheel, which is really cool because if you look on how they design this rim, the laces actually run to the outside, which gives it a, a very aggressive um, but distinct look that is all its own. So that looks amazing. Rolling on through, you also are gonna have LED turn signals. Uh, this one's also been upgraded with some uh, screens on the headlight sides with additional LED lights for even more lighting because it's better to be seen and also be able to see uh, than the latter of uh, neither of those. So rolling on through, we have a chopped engine guard. We also are powered by the monstrous 117 cubic inch Milwaukee 8 motor. Um, this also has, if you notice, the bronze armor and this unique finish is also uh, followed through on your lower rocker box covers, push, uh, push rod tubes, and on the exhaust heat shields itself, while also rolling through uh, the unique Kahuna collection on here as well. So you have Kahuna collection footboards, brake pedal, heated hand grips, which is really nice to have that years ago you couldn't get heated grips on a CVO, you had to apply those after. Now they come on the CVO Road Glide, which is awesome. Also, Kahuna passenger pegs, keep things discreet uh, with a few other features. As we continue to roll through, you notice the speakers and the saddlebag lids. These are the Rockford Fosgate Harley-Davidson uh, stage two speakers. So the unique thing about this setup is these speakers in the saddlebags and in the fairing are designed to be pointed at you as the rider. So uh, it creates a really, really um, concert-like uh, sound quality. So when you're actually sitting on the bike, these are angled, so everything's coming at you uh, for an amazing uh, audio experience that really, uh, it cranks uh, at the end of the day. You can blast Taylor Swift or Nickelback as loud as you want on this thing till your ears bleed. Uh, you also are gonna have the stretch CVO style saddlebags, which are really cool. Do have the attachment of the um, skid plate on the bottom of these with a discreet CVO badge across the back, letting people know with a bright orange, uh, this is a uh, blaze orange, Bar and shield, just for a little pop uh, to give some unique uh, touch points on this. You'll also notice those on the grips. They're also gonna be on your footboards and a few other details around the bike. This bike's also been upgraded with a color matched Chop Tour Pack. Chop Tour Packs are nice because they give you great passenger comfort with a discreet look that goes great on a road glide especially, um, while also giving you a little bit more room for things you wanna store in here, um, including in here, you'll notice factory CVO cover, which you can put on the motorcycle. And then that brings us to our keys. A lot of people on YouTube like to like do this like nice thing where they show the key, but these, cool, these keys are actually legitimately very cool. So you have a pop-up barrel key on here. You're also gonna have remote locks. So you can lock your saddlebags um, right from the key fob, which is super awesome. Uh, plus, it says Harley Davidson CVO. That's a sweet looking key, so eat your heart out. As we go to the seat, this is a two piece seat. So if you wanted to take this tour pack off, take off this passenger pillion, you could do that, run a solo low profile seat 
for a really nice custom bagger look. It also has diamond stitching in here as well, uh, which just adds to that premium aesthetic of a CVO. Um, you really can't build one of these bikes for less, and this is a super uh, nice um, addition of one. So with that said, on to the other side, you're gonna have a 117 Derby cover, and even on your horn cover, you're gonna have that uh, red bar and shield on there as well for those little touches. And as we roll up onto here, you're gonna have the 6.5 GTS infotainment system. You're gonna have the really cool um, fast style factory handlebars. You're gonna have rider safety enhancements, which include your TPMS sensors with 90 degree valve stems. Makes checking your tire pressure and adjusting it much easier. Plus it takes the guesswork out of what your air pressures are. You're gonna have cornering enhanced linked ABS brakes. So not only do they link at certain speeds uh, above 20 to 25 miles an hour, they're corner enhanced. So they work with an IMU, which is an inertia measurement unit underneath your seat, basically. Um, that allows to help in emergency situations for us to stop more effectively in corners. Really nice to have. You're gonna have traction control. Yes, you can turn it off. You also have a rain mode, um, but that is also cornering enhanced to help us as riders as well. And then rolling from there, you have drag torque slip control, which is a really cool feature. You're gonna have hill hold control, which you hear people talk about, which is where you can activate that on a hill. So it uses your ABS to hold the bike. You can let go of your brake, run your throttle. You can either tap your brake to deactivate that or ride out of it. Um, as well as some other really nice, uh, basically technology that we can run through in person with you to avoid a 20, long, uh, 20 minute long video. Then you have flush mount fuel cap, a unique CVO style center console, which is really nice with illuminated Harley Davidson CVO uh, badge up here. And then color matched interfering as well. And really when you break it down on some of the other things, you have the custom mirrors, you have a low profile windshield in the front. It's really designed to give you that factory custom look with uh, just a really amazing compilation of both factory and custom accessories right out of the gate. With that said, this one's a beauty and it's only got 1,270 miles. So great example of a really nice CVO. New CVOs are pretty much sold out across the nation uh, for the year. So this is a really nice opportunity to still get on a um, very low mileage uh, edition of one. And plus, if you haven't sat on one or seen one in person, it's a really nice opportunity to do that. A lot of people didn't get to this year. So with that said, check out more pictures and information at wilkinsharley.com on this bike and all the others we have. Inventory does still change daily this time of year. And uh, you also can give us a call, 802-476-6104, or swing down and check it out. We have some cool events if you need an excuse to come down or beat the crowds and check it out anyway. It's a great reason to get out of the house uh, or do something outside of work. With that said, thank you very much. If you have questions, hit us up um, and we can run through the rest of the details in person because there's still more to go over. Thank you guys, ride safe, appreciate you.